Uh, African Queen writes this, Mr. Fuller. It says, good morning, Mr. Fuller. Um, I want to thank you for answering uh, other questions that I've sent in to you. I want to share something with you, Mr. Fuller, and ask your opinion on this. A friend of mine, he lives overseas, was dating a white woman up until recently, a few weeks ago, for 10 to 12 years, on and off. Now, a, I'm reading it the way that it was written, now, A, have always w- warned him about interracial dating, but according to him, she wasn't a racist. A few days ago, he told me that he was home taking a nap before work and heard his girlfriend downstairs yelling, so he went to take a look and saw her yelling at the TV, calling Cam Newton a nigger, and other disrespectful words. He was in shock and said he stood there for about five minutes in disbelief. When he approached her and asked her what was that, her reply was, it's nothing personal. She, I'm reading it just the way she said it. He don't see him that way and he needs to calm down. He said in that moment he finally understood what you've been saying or what she'd been saying to him. Mr. Fuller, what is your opinion on this cause? I know I'm not surprised, and I strongly believe all white people wait for the right opportunity to show their true colors. Uh, and, then, and then, Mr. Fuller, uh, uh, if he's working on the book, when will it come to Jamaica and the rest of the Caribbean? Thank you. Oh, I'm trying to get it so that they will go overseas. I, I've said that over and over again so that I can distribute overseas. I'm having problems just distributing right here locally in this area of the world. But I'm working on it all the time. I have some people working with me. They're trying to figure out the best way to go about doing this. But in reference to what he said about the interaction between himself and the white female, that's to be expected. And he shouldn't be shocked. And uh, because we are in a system of racism, we are not in any other system. There is no other system. I want to emphasize that. There's no such thing as some other government on the planet Earth. Now, maybe on some other planet, naturally, because we are not there. But this system that we have, a system of government, world government, world government, not just some locality somewhere over on the other side of the tracks of some city. It's the world government. There's only one government on this planet. It's called the system of white supremacy. So it's natural that a white woman would be using the N-word or any other derogatory terms to refer to the people who are the victims of that system. That goes with the territory. And the N-word, if it was used every day by every white person, would be a natural thing. It's almost natural among black people themselves. We understand it at that level, but we still like to think that, well, you know, people don't really mean it the way that it really means and all like that. It goes with the system, the system of white supremacy. We're not in any other system. We're not in Oz or Shangri-La. Wow. So you're not surprised at that. <laughs> wow. Woo. Mm. Uh, she wanted to know, well, uh, she, she, she indicated that she did try to tell him that this would eventually happen. Uh, you know. Yes, it's not personal. It's business. She said so herself. It's not personal. That's what she said. It's yeah. not personal. Uh, it's business. The business of white supremacy. Only business on earth that counts. There is no other business. Everybody understands this, but everybody is going around trying to pretend that they don't.